okay let me stop it welcome so we'll just um, quickly go to the shelf upstairs and we created some of the pyro fx let's go with uh, ground explosion give it a second to create the network and here we have it let's have a look Simpler. Let's connect this one. Let's connect this one. This one. I don't want the uh, trails and stuff. Let's go here. Let's make it run for a while. quick explosion but um, let's go to this frame and have a look so we are interested in the viral pick so without it this is how our same will look or when we imported it it look like this these are the density so here in the barrel look let's create a new one big volume and let's take it from the field so this is how we initially created it so this is the smoke the amount of smoke the density and the shadow density the ambient occlusion shadow scatter we can add the scatter we can compute its volume how much dense and the intensity also and this is the fire we can compute its intensity also here let's increase it and if we have secondary fire also like fire trail it will show up and here the bin binding so the density is for the density you are using the temperature that being masked by the density for the scatter and the fire we are using the fire so we can use flame for instance see flames and here we can play with the masking so we can have more area that's being burned or less area that will be masked by the smoke now from here we have a couple of options let's say we want to render a frame from this one inside it we have the material the viral shader already connected so I will create a camera by control and I will create a light let's say environment light and some distant light ok let's go back to the camera and the out we'll use first mantra This is where, like, uh, let's say, I have it here, and I want to keep the render display here. 
so with pressing control it will render this one but it's showing this one okay so in mantra object let's go and have a render let me save using the viral bag and it is being rendered let's minimize the environment light a little bit and the distant light a little bit more okay let me stop it and go back here and see what other option we have here I can create light camera, create render stage, or create a cache the simulation. When I cache the simulation, it will cache it as PGZ or VDB. So I'll cache one frame, save, and let me read it. Where did it cache? render again and see if it will work and it didn't work here so let's find out why we have only the scatter I need all of this save it in a much better way with velocity and everything not only the scatter because all of these are VDBs you see the other option we have we have also here create render stage yes as a daylight accept so now we are in Solaris of this one I'm <coughs> <coughs> sorry and I will choose the same camera so automatically it uh, added the Give it a 